Hello everyone, this is the Gaming Pup here, and today I am back for another game in the indie gaming series. This time, I am playing Le Voyage dans la Lune, or as it translates to, A Trip to the Moon. This is based on a very famous short film by Georges Méliès, Méliès, however you pronounce uh, his last name, I'm not good with pronunciation. Jorge Melez. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that correctly. If I'm not, I am so sorry. But it's a very famous short film that came out in 1902. And I think a lot of people have seen at least one of the images for it. Uh, the moon with the spaceship in its eye. Very famous. But uh, he was a director, actor, and illusionist. A pioneer of early cinema. So, without further ado, let's get started. Okay. Arrow keys. Hmm. Alright. I like it. I like the style. Very cartoonish. You know, I don't, I don't have a problem with that. I hope everyone's doing well today. Uh, I know I'm, I've been feeling better in recent days. My smell and taste are coming back. So that's nice. Here's the shot that I was talking about. That. Very famous. Oh. Also, he was the first to do a fictional narrative uh, for film. Hmm. Okay, platforming, I see. You can glide by hold and jump. Thank you. Alright. It's very cutesy. I like the art style. I do like it, you know. You can grow mushrooms. Keyboard P, joystick B. Okay. Oh. All right, there's mushrooms on the moon. Use your umbrella to hit, oh. Okay, there's plant life on the moon, but this is sci-fi. This was one of the first sci-fi films uh, in history, so. Um, to me, that that is like, major and I love I enjoy sci-fi I do love sci-fi only some films not not or shows not like everything sci-fi but you know um, hmm let me think about this so I could go immediately down if I wanted to Kill the creature if I wanted to, but why would I want to do that? I will do it. Okay, that wasn't helpful. Ah. Okay, that didn't help at all. Ah, damn you. What are you anyway? That's what I'm trying... But this is sci-fi, so, you know, not everything's gonna make sense. That creature's now just walking on the bottom. Oh, shoot. Come here! You're not coming. There we go. Oh! Okay, I did that again. And there we go. I somehow killed the creature. Alright. I like this. I really like this. This is... You know, it's... Um... I, I definitely say it's a bit different. 
Oh, is it really that different? It's it's nice to see a um a game based on an old short film. It, it's nice to see a f sort of film-based game. I really enjoy movies. Can you please put down a mushroom? Thank you. Uh, oh. Wait, I got an idea. I don't know if we can defeat this one. So, I think we'll just have to... Oh, crap! Okay. I got an idea. Like that. Okay, not like that. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. Spikes on the walls. Normally I'm not good with platformers, but this is not a, a difficult platformer. Oh. Okay, we've been caught. <laughs> Where are you taking us? Ah, to your leader. Yes. This is sci-fi. Take me to your leader. Alright, hello. How are you doing, king or queen or... I'll kill you! Oh boy. Woo! I was pressing the arrow key. Oh, fun. I'm so sorry about the music. I know, it's really loud. I'm so sorry. Okay. So we killed their leader. They chased after us. And now we're back on Earth. Alright, and we are standing on top of a small version of the moon. We've conquered the moon, basically. Alright. That was nice. That was a cool little short game. I love the art style. But, uh, yeah. Uh, if you want to try this out for yourself, I will leave a link down below for you to check it out. Thank you for playing. Coding in Art by Bartholomew Namra. And additional backgrounds by Just Justine Barney, or... Justine, Justine, sorry. Justine Barney. That is most likely their uh, their Twitters or Instagrams. If you want to check them out, you can. That was a fun little game. I hope everyone's doing well. Hope everyone's staying safe. If you like this, please leave a thumbs up. Comment down below. And once you've done that, please hit the subscribe button and the bell to stay notified when I upload a new video. And I will see everyone in the next one. Bye-bye.